Today we play Super Mario Party Jamboree playing the first board of the game, Mega Wiggler's Tree Party. This is my first time ever playing this board and it's so nice to get to play these boards after trying all of the mini games and after fully completing the story mode. It is so fun to play these boards, this is a new Mario Party game and I have a lot planned for videos about this game. Thank you so much for watching and I really hope you enjoy this video. Roll the dice to move around a board. There are three types of spaces, hooray, watch out, or how exciting. After each player has had a turn, everyone will clash in a mini game. Win mini games to get coins. Once you've collected 20 coins, you can exchange them for a star. The player with the most stars at the end wins and earns the title of superstar. Jamboree buddies can help you out with all sorts of neat activities. Wait, just having one with you will allow you to do a bunch of things twice. Okay, so Jamboree buddies are great. They appear on the board now and again, so pay them a visit if they do. However, they'll only join as your ally if you win it in a mini game against the other players. The player who initiates the mini game will gain an advantage, so it pays to be quick. That's all for the explanation. We're off on a journey to superstardom. Let's start with Mega Wiggler's Tree Party. All right, Mega Wiggler's Tree Party. Time for the first board of the game. We were actually here in story mode, but when we were here during story mode, we weren't actually rolling the dice. We were just free to walk around and help the people and play mini games. But now we are actually playing against other CPUs, so this is very exciting. And it'll be so fun to play this with my sister. Welcome one and all! We're here to find out which one of you has what it takes to be the superstar! Is this anyone's first time playing on this board? Why don't you explain it to me? Tell me what happens. A giant wiggler sleeps peacefully in this quiet forest. The air is filled with the smell of sweets. Things are so calm here, even the piranha plants are napping. It's dangerous to wake them up, so pass by quickly. All the treats are made with the fort's honey harvested here. Help harvest the honey to earn coins. You can walk on top of Mega Wiggler, but be careful. Sometimes Mega Wiggler will move or get angry. Complete a lap around the board to get coins. It might not be a bad idea to just go around and around. Now first, let's use the dice to determine the turn order. All right, let's see. Give me a nice big roll. Yeah, we're first. That is great. What a great start. Oh, that's so cool how that shows up. That's new. That wasn't in Mario Party Superstars. Yeah. Oh, before we begin, there's ten coins for each of you. Oh, man, this is an exciting start. Roll the dice block and make for where the star is. And where is the star? First star is... Right up that way. Okay, I got it. And wait. And there with 20 coins to get the star. Yeah. Now that you're all set, it's time to get the show on the road. Give it your best shot out there. Good luck and have fun. Thanks, Toad. Turn one out of ten. Oh, and that's so nice that it saves at the beginning of every turn. First time party goer achievement earned. Very nice. Okay, let's go ahead and roll. And we start the game with a one. My first ever roll. Whoa. That's so cool the way that it is tilted like that and the background gets blurry. Oh, cool. Plus seven coins. That's nice. Well, good thing I could go and afford this star. But it's too bad that I'm so far back. What are you getting? A big roll? An eight. 14 away from the star and he gets an 8. Look at that. Look at how lucky he is. Welcome. Do you want to buy something? Okay, Yoshi spends 5 coins. What is he getting at the item shop? Double dice block. Roll 2 dice, then move that total amount. Okay, maybe I'm going to be buying an item when I pass by. Okay, Yoshi's actually going this way. Oh, I wonder if that's a shortcut going up that way. Let's see. What is he getting? Another double dice. Man. I wonder if there's going to be a bonus start for most spaces traveled, and I wonder if Yoshi's going to get that. Right. We'll go ahead and roll Princess Peach. She rolls, and she gets a seven. Okay. And is she going to be buying something from the shop also? Let's see. She also spends five points. Also a double dice block or something? Oh, no, a Wiggler Bell. Okay, so I guess that's what wakes up Wiggler and makes him angry, and that makes him move. Wait, she's landing on the event space. Let's see. Rings the bell, and what's going to happen? Because Yoshi's on Wiggler. Does he fly away, or does he just move somewhere? Okay. Looks like he's just there. Okay, so Yoshi can't really go to the star now. <laughs> Maybe he has to get off at the other path, unless Wiggler ends up moving again. Oh, cool, and we could do reactions. I could do hi. Or what? Haha, <laughs> that's kind of funny that these characters have different stamps like this that you could use. See ya. Okay, so what is uh, Luigi doing? Okay, he spends five coins. Is he getting... He also gets a Wiggler Bell. Okay, so both Peach and Luigi have the Wiggler Bells. 
You know, that could be good. Wait, oh, he doesn't choose to land on the event space. Smart choice. And what do you get? Seven coins. Okay, so Luigi's up to 12 coins. Nobody can afford this star yet, which is nice. Okay, time for a mini game. What is the mini game going to be? What kind of mini game is it? Ah, uh, one versus three mini game. Wow, they really make it very clear why you have a one versus three or a four player mini game. Sunset standoff, okay. I have never been on the team of three for this mini game. We have to survive five rounds. That's crazy. How are we gonna survive five rounds of this? Where are you going, Peach? Let's run here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, we need at least one person to survive for all five rounds. Because if you get hit by the bullet bill, you are out. Uh oh. Let's go there! Okay, goodbye to Yoshi. Three more rounds. Go, man, five rounds. That's quite a few that you have to survive for if you want to win this. Let's see. Let's see. Come, Luigi! Good job, Luigi. Good job, good job, good job. If the two of us survive to the final round, we should just stand at opposite ends. Because Peach wouldn't be able to get both of us, right? No! No! Luigi, it's all up to you. It's all up to you. You can do it, Luigi. You can do it. I, no! Why would you do that, Luigi? You ran right into it! Oh, man, that is so sad. And so sad. Our first minigame ever on a board, and we lose it. Will we even be able to win? We get no coins, and Peach gets 10 coins. That brings her up to second place. Oh, that's kind of cool how it shows the ranking like that. There are a lot of really cool details that they added in this game. All right, hopefully I get a bigger roll this turn. Wait! Uh, can I charge up for a bigger roll? Am I allowed to do that? Am I allowed to do that? It seemed like that's what happened. Oh, custom dice block pipe. Move to another space. There's no telling where you'll go. Oh, that's actually kind of funny. If you're just in a spot that you really don't like, then you can just teleport to another random spot. Shop hop box. Move to right before an item shop. There's no telling which shop you'll move to. That's kind of interesting too. You know what? I've got to go with a double dice block. I'd love to get some big rolls. That'd be very nice, especially if we do well in the minigame, then maybe we'd be able to reach the star next turn. That'd be absolutely fantastic if we could do that. Okay, we land on a blue if we go there, or lucky if we go there. Let's go here and land on the blue. Let's see, very nice. Very nice, a nice blue space here. We get three more coins now, all we need is five more coins. What are you gonna do, Yoshi? Are you gonna use your double dice block? He's 30 from the start. Oh, and he has two double dice blocks, I forgot about that. So let's see what he's gonna roll. A five, and a two. Just a seven, not a very big roll. And he is off to... Going down this way. Cool, lands on a lucky space. That's so cool, this almost seems like VR, the way that that menu shows up on the side like that. Wait, did he just get another double dice block? Yes, he did. That's actually pretty funny. Oh, Peach is choosing to use the Wiggler Bell again. Wait. Does that mean that she might be moving towards the star now? Is that a shortcut to the star if you go up that way? That might be actually. Let's see, seven away from the star now, but... Oh, she gets just a three. Okay, so she is landing on Wiggler. Well, if she chooses to go that way yeah, and getting a lucky spot there. And she gets double dice. Okay, so I can't let her win this upcoming mini game. I definitely don't want her to win the upcoming minigame. Hopefully Luigi is also landing on a blue spot. Oh, he's also using the Wiggler Belt. Man, everyone just loves using the Wiggler Bells here. Okay, so let's see. Oh, actually, now it doesn't matter because now Peach is heading down that way. So who cares where Luigi lands now? Just don't want Luigi to get a lot of coins. Luigi gets an eight. Wait, 13 to the star. That means he's gonna be five away from the star now. Okay, and he just passes by the Piranha Plant. He gets three coins from there. Everyone except for Yoshi has bonus 15 minigame. coins now. Oh, bonus minigame? Really? Already? Oh, that's kind of funny. Okay, four-player minigame because we were all on blue spots. Minigame is... Sandwich! Okay. First place gets 20 coins. Second place gets six coins, though, so they might be able to uh, get a star before me. That'd be bad if someone got a star before me. Okay, let's see. Where are we going to go? Where are we going to go? Uh-oh. Don't want to get sandwiched. Don't want to get sandwiched. Don't want to get sandwiched. Okay, go! Look out. Look out, bros. Let's see where we're gonna go next. This is a nice spot, I think. This is a nice spot, I think. Let's see. Let's see, where are you going, Luigi? 
I probably gotta move soon. Gotta move soon. Gotta move soon. Okay. Whoa, 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 I think it might be a better idea to stay near the bottom, because if you stay near the bottom, then you don't have the, uh, other sandwiches that are falling block your view of if there's a shadow appearing on your sandwich. That's great that we got an extra 20 coins there. Luigi can afford the star, though, which is scary. This is a little scary. This is slightly scary. But we can choose to look around like this. How far are we from the star? The star is- wait, where is the star? I thought the star was right here somewhere. Is the star up this? Oh, there's the star. Ten away. We can definitely get a ten, right? Right? Come on. Give me a ten. Give me at least a ten. Come on. Come on, we can do it. Nine? And nine! Oh, cool! Ten extra coins for getting the same number twice. If you hold down the A button, do you get a bigger roll? Because that's happened three times now. I wonder if you can do that. I really wonder if that's something that you could do. Mario has reached the star. Yes, I am going to buy the star. Very nice. And I could also afford another star, so it'd be funny if the next star was somewhere nearby. There we go! You got a star. You got a star. Very nice. First star achievement earned. Hooray! Congratulations, Mario! Let's see, where will the next star be? It'll be down here! Oh, is a Princess Peach near there? I think she might be heading that way in a moment. Well, where are we going? Let's see. Oh! Welcome! The items I sell are special, and you can't find them anywhere else! Interested? Creepy dice block. Instead of cursed dice block, make it so that someone could only roll a number between one and three. Wait. You could use super creepy dice block on all of your opponents. That's such a cool idea. Oh, dueling glove. Choose an opponent to duel with coins on the line. That might be the best option. I think I'm gonna have to take that one. Thanks for your business! Yeah, that'll be great. Very nice, very nice. So, I don't know if I'm necessarily going to duel who has the most coins, or am I going to duel who is closest to the star? This is a pretty fun game. And this board does seem pretty simple. At first I thought, huh, this seems like a pretty big board. Maybe it's going to be a bit complicated, but it seems kind of straightforward. Oh, and you get 10 coins for passing by there. That's very nice. Wait, I wonder, Yoshi didn't go to the right there. I wonder if that's because you have to loop around if you want to get to that star. Maybe you do, actually. How far away is Peach from the star? 20 to the star. So if she gets double tens, she is reaching. But I don't know if that will happen. Let's see. Eight. And six. Still some pretty big rolls. She gets very close to the star. And she could almost afford it. Okay, so, oh wait, no, she can afford it because she just got plus 10 coins here. Okay, so Peach is probably going to be the closest to the star. And wait, is she buying anything? She buys. Double dice block. Okay, so she is almost guaranteed reaching the star next turn. If she chooses to go up. Okay, and she does choose to go up. Okay, so Peach is almost guaranteed getting the star next turn. How far away is Luigi? Luigi's 30 away. Okay, so I think dueling Princess Peach is likely going to be a good idea. That's probably what I should do. I should probably duel her for as many coins as possible, if that is going to be an option. Man, what a sweet board. This is a really cool, detailed board. It's so fun to be playing the boards now of this game. It was nice to go through all the mini games and to play the story mode, but now we're gonna have some fun playing the boards. Hot cross blocks. All right, what is this one again? Oh, no! I know this mini game. Okay, I want... Uh, I think the top one's the best, to be honest. Okay, nice, nice. And that lets us go the farthest. Yoshi's was also a good choice because there are two things that connect to that, but now I need something that connects to the top. So, the top one is my only option. Let's see. Hooray! We actually got it. Okay, but now I'm tied with- wait! No, I'm not tied with Yoshi, because that doesn't connect to his. That's kind of funny that he chose that. Okay, I need something that connects to the top. Uh, the second option would be good, or the bottom one. Let's see. Let's do the bottom one. No one should be doing that. Yes! Okay, very good! Very good. Very, very nice, okay. Now I could do- Oh! Oh, 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 oh. 
Uh, you know what? Bottom one is nice. Second from the bottom is also good. Yes! Very nice! Now I'm only one away. I'm just one away. Oh, Princess Peach is at the very beginning. So, as long as I get something that connects to the bottom, I'm good. So why don't I choose the top one? Let's see that. Ah, okay, Luigi chose the L, but he can't connect to that. So it looks like Luigi is taking a bit of an L. And is top one good for me? Uh, I think the top one is fine. Top one is fine. Yes, and we actually get it. Okay, Luigi gets it. No, he doesn't get to move forward a bit. He's taking another L. Look at that. Oh, and that's funny. Your rank is actually based on where you are when the person in first completes the minigame. All right, that's sweet. So, we get 10 coins. Luigi gets three. Yoshi gets two. Oh, nice. Peach is in last place. Order is restored to the universe. As we say, because Princess Peach always seems to be in last place on this channel. Oh, and you know what? Even though Princess Peach is in last place... Wait, 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 how close is Yoshi to the star? Uh, Princess Peach is a bit closer to the star than Yoshi is, so... I do have to duel Princess Peach. Cause, if I could only duel one of them, there is a bigger chance that Peach is going to reach the star, so I definitely want to stop her. Okay, so she gets smacked with the dueling glove. And it's time for a duel minigame. How many coins to wager? Okay, yes, I do get to choose. Wagering 23 coins, let's go. What is the dual minigame gonna be? Man, the dual minigames in Mario Party Superstars were really great. Oh yes, I love this one, I love this one. This is such a great one, okay. So, you have five HP every time you... Ah! Every time you get smacked, you get hurt. And when the other person jumps, you can uh, jump over the hand. Oh no, like that. Go, there we go, whacked her. Okay, let's see. Come on, jump, 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 go on. There we go, got her, she has one HP. Come on, you gotta try, Peach. Finish. There we go, I dodged it and she smacked herself. That means we are the Winner. victor, very nice. That's such a fun one. One of my favorite dual mini games for sure. And we get a lot of coins for that, very nice. 54 coins in total now. Now, might as well roll normally. Can I charge up? Ah, I get another kind of big number, I wonder. Wait! Oh! <laughs> oh, I feel quite evil. Now, I can steal some coins from Yoshi, because he is the closest to the star. So this is actually great, so he has to mash it. Hopefully we can steal at least five coins. Come on, let's go. Give me some coins. How many do we get? That! Okay, nice, that looked like a lot of coins, nine coins. No one had a star to steal. It's funny that I could afford stealing a star, but no one else had a star to steal. Oh, no! No! No, 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 no! No, 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 not chance time. Okay, let's see. Let's see. I need to go. Let's see, after it is, is it random every time or what? Okay, after the second, there we go, there we go. Okay, now it's just three coins. That's exactly what I was focusing on trying to get. Now it doesn't matter who is where. If it's me here, that'd be nice. But I don't know how long it takes me to jump up. Okay, someone's giving three coins to Luigi. Yoshi's giving three coins to Luigi. Okay, even better. Yeah, I saw that there was the option for give three coins. After the second star and coin swap, so that's what I was trying to aim for. I'm so glad that I didn't jump too early because there's a possibility that I could have swapped coins and stars with somebody else and that would have been incredibly sad. Okay, so Yoshi chooses to not buy anything. He's seven from the star, <laughs> but he chooses to go the other way. He could have actually reached the star that turn, but that's so funny that I stole coins from him so he wasn't able to afford the star. Kind of funny that he went around this way, though, instead of going in a circle. Now, what about you, Peach? What are you going to do? Regular dice block. A three. And that means you're almost at the star still, but you have no money. Well, you have three coins, so kind of sad for you. Kind of sad for you, isn't it? Okay, and what about you, Luigi? 24 to the star. As long as we don't land on chance times, as long as nobody lands on some chance times, I'm gonna be pretty happy. Oh nice, Luigi actually takes a nice shortcut over here, and he lands on an event space, so he's ringing the bell here. And that Mega Wiggler runs around like that. Okay, so let's see, what kind of minigame are we going to have? Because Luigi and I both minigame. landed on green, so let's see if we become blue or red. Or blue and red. Or red and blue. Or blue and blue. Looks like we were blue and blue. 
Okay, and the four-player minigame we have is... Scarousel. Okay, I was kind of hoping for domination. Start. Okay, over here we just gotta be careful to not get out. Don't get zapped. Do not get zapped. That's all we have to do. Oh, and maybe don't get hit by the chain chump. I'm guessing that if you get hit by the chain chump, that also takes you out. Yeah, we want to be fast enough to not get pushed back too far. Okay, and people are already getting zapped here. Let's see, there are two people out already. Oh, three people out. There we go, that was fast. Nice, so we get another ten coins. You know what would be funny? If over here, in this screen over here, the farther ahead you are, the higher up you appear than the others. That'd be cool if they did that. Okay, our turn. Oh, Luigi's right in front of us. Let's go ahead and roll, charge up, and... A seven. So odd that I got a one the first time I rolled. Now I'm getting all these big ones. Okay, we landed on the red, so we lose three coins. Kind of funny how instead of the coins disappearing upwards, they fall out, almost like they're falling out of your pockets or something. Okay, 41 to the star for Yoshi, and he's choosing to use a double dice block. He can now afford the star, so can Luigi. Oh, and Yoshi gets double sixes, look at that. That's kind of funny that this is the second time on this board already where we have had double numbers. I had double numbers earlier, and now Yoshi's having double numbers. Okay, and he is taking the shorter path here. Okay, Yoshi also lands on a red, so it looks like we are going to be on the same team for the minigame. Wait! You can have hidden blocks on red spaces?! How many coins is that? Wow, 20 coins! That's pretty good! Okay, Peach rolls just a three. A little roll. Oh, oh, that's so funny. Three away from the star. Can't afford it. So sad for her. She lands on the same spot as me. No duel. Because, it's, well, I'm guessing there are maybe going to be duels during the last five turns. So maybe starting next turn there are going to be duels. Wait, so far everyone's landed on red except for Luigi. Okay, so it's all of us versus Luigi in this minigame. Let's see how we can do. One versus three minigame. Let's see what it's going to be. It is... Cage catch. Oh, so I guess we have to uh, trap Luigi. Okay, so I have to move left and right to try and catch him. Let's go. Get him. Yeah, we got him on the first try. That's so good. That was my first time being on the team of three for this mini game. Cool, so we all get ten coins. Only five turns left. Let's see what's going to happen. Home stretch. So are there now duels? I'm guessing there are now going to be duels. We're down to the last five turns. Let's take a look at the current standings. First place, Mario, then Yoshi, Luigi, and Peach. Everyone's really fired up. This is one exciting matchup. Now that we're in the home stretch, blue spaces will give you six, twice as many as before. But you'll also lose six coins on red spaces now, so watch your step. Also, if two or more players land on the same space, a duel will begin. Anyone can still pull ahead, so don't give up now. Finally, we'll decide on a special event for the home stretch. This time, fourth place gets to decide. Wait, what's happening? What's happening, Peach? Choose an event! One player receives a mushroom. Oh wait, I didn't read that one. What was it? Oh, wait, what is that? All players get something. There's still time to turn the tables. For example, if you use a trump call to move the star, it might end up in front of you. And also, try landing on the same space as an opponent to start a duel. If you win, you can steal their coins. It's not over yet, so do your best. Cool. Wait. Well, Luigi now. Oh, jamboree. there's the guy. There's the jamboree buddy. Make me your ally if you want to wipe the floor with the competition. Oh, man. Okay, yeah, yeah. Wait, steal three to eight coins from opponents you pass? That's so cool. And if you pass by the star, then you can buy two at a time for 40 coins, of course. That sounds amazing. You have only three turns to get Waluigi as an ally, so go, go, go. Oh man, he's way back there. Is anyone close to him? Nobody's really close to him. Peach and I are the closest. I don't know if we can make it to him. How far away is that? 22 spots away. And wait, what is this item? Star steal trap. Place up to two spaces ahead or behind to steal a star from an opponent who stops there. <laughs> oh no. Let's charge up. Go. A 10. Wait, can you just charge up like that and get the biggest roll possible that you want? Cool, 10 coins for passing by, that's nice. Now the question is, oh, this is gonna be such a tough choice. Okay, wait, but first, let's look at what's in the shop. Updated inventory, yeah, let me buy something. Gold pipes are for sale. You know what, I think we're gonna have to get that gold pipe. I think we're gonna have to get that gold pipe just because we have so many coins. What are people gonna do with the star steel traps though? I really don't like star steel traps. These are kind of like hexes from Mario Party DS. 
Okay, if I get a four, then I'll be three away from the star, then I'll be really close to the star. Or, I could start going this way and try to get Waluigi, but there's not a guarantee that we're going to get Waluigi. Ah, uh, and he's only here for a few more turns. I think I might as well go for this star, because you know what? If I go for this star, then maybe the next star will be somewhere near Waluigi, and then I'll be able to use the gold pipe, and then I'll be able to also get Waluigi. That'd be really nice if all of that could happen. Okay, what are you using? You're putting down a star steel trap, bro. Please, no. Okay, you're putting one over there. If someone lands on that, then Yoshi gets a star. This is absolute chaos. You're also getting a 10. What's with all the giant rolls now? Okay, are you buying anything? Let's see. You want to buy an item? Yeah, yeah. What are you buying? A boo bell or something, maybe? Oh, only six coins, so what? A chomp call. That can really make things crazy. I wonder what happens if you land on your own. Oh. Oh. No! No! Oh, Yoshi, no! No! No, that is so sad, so sad. Everyone comment, so sad, you lost your star. That is so sad. So sad, I can't believe that. Oh man, he could just barely afford that. That is really so, so sad. So sad, it'd be so funny if he landed on chance time and then gave it back to me, that would have been amazing. Okay, and he gets a creepy dice block. Ah, oh, man, that's not good. This is not good. This is not very good at all. Hey, what are you doing? You're also putting down a star steel trap? Yeah, sure, go ahead, whatever. Where are you putting it down? Right there, huh? Okay, so I don't want to land there. That's the lesson learned. And you get a seven, okay? Nice roll. Nice roll, and you get ten coins for passing by here, so you can now afford the star. Oh, if she used the double dice block, there's actually a bit of a chance that she would have been able to get to the star this turn and buy it. Okay, but instead she spends 12 coins on a custom dice block. You could roll any number you want from 1 to 10. I wonder if holding A and charging up actually makes you have a bigger roll though. Because it seems like that is happening, or at least happening for me. Okay, you're all putting down your star steel traps. Man, you guys, you just really want people to fall for this, to fall for these star steel traps, to land on them. Okay, and where are you going, Luigi? A ten! Another gigantic roll! These people and their big rolls! Okay, and he gets another ten coins for passing by here. Ha, ah, where is this star going after next turn, though? That is the question. That is the important question. Okay, let's see. Are you buying something? You must be buying something. Oh, man! Luigi also wants a gold pie. And he could also afford another start. Is he gonna have dual peach? Uh-oh! It'd be so funny if he lost. If he lost a bunch of coins to peach. Okay, 16 coins, okay. He wants the dual peach for all of her money. I kind of hope that Luigi loses because he has a gold pipe. So if he has a gold pipe and no coins, that'd be hilarious. And? No, he won! That's worse! That is the worst option. That is definitely the worst option. That's not good that that happened. Okay, let's see what minigame we are going to have. What is the minigame? Four player minigame? And what is the minigame? Let's see. Stamp out! Oh, this should be easy. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Gotta make lots of pink everywhere. We want lots of pink. Uh-oh, low battery! Well, it makes sense that the battery is getting a little bit low. Okay, you know what? You want to cover mine? Fine, I'll cover yours then. You want that? You want that? You want this? You want this? Fine, I'll cover your spaces. You want me to cover your spaces? I can cover your spaces. I'll cover your blue over here. Move, Luigi. There we go. I'll cover your blue. Take that, Yoshi. Take that. Take this. And go here. And go there. And go here. Oh, a lot of green there from Peach. I was hoping I'd be able to cover up some more green from Peach there. She's probably in second. Yeah, she's in second with 8%. I'm in first with 29%. Very nice. Oh man, Yoshi's in first place because he has a star. Only four turns left. Okay, only four turns left. This guy's only here for a few turns. It's my... Wait. Where am I? Okay, so we don't want a four because that would make us land on the trap. And other than that, we can get anything. If I get a 10, that'd be nice because then I can duel Luigi or Peach. Then I could duel Luigi for all his money. A 10 would be the perfect roll, actually. Let's go charge up and... Wait. Oh, we at least reached the star! 
Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. That is fine. I thought, wait, three. Are we even reaching the star? But yeah, we just wanted to not get a four. I guess a one or two would have also been a bad roll because then someone else could have stolen the star from under our nose. But it's nice that we got that. And where's the next star? Ah, over there. So you know what? I wonder if Luigi's gonna use his gold pipe. And I wonder if there's gonna be- Whoa! Oh yeah, that's right. It's minus six coins now. I wonder if there could possibly be a bonus star for- Whoa, he has a lot of items. Yeah, I wonder if there could possibly be a bonus star for who lands on the most red spaces. Man, and blue coins are- or blue spaces are really quite nice. You get a lot of coins from them. Look at the Goomba and the Koopa having a conversation there on the logs. Peach gets a seven. I don't think that's landing on me, is it? No, that's past me, probably. She doesn't even go that way. Wait! <gasps> she lands on me! Okay, oh, but she has only three coins. Yeah. Yeah. Might as well duel. Oh, you want to duel two coins? Well, why wouldn't you... I guess, you know what? I was going to say, why wouldn't you duel? Because whether you win or lose, you're not going to have any coins left because you landed on a red spot. Wait, can I just boost up here? Nope, I can't. Here, now I can come up. And, get me up there. Here we go. And, let's keep going. Let's see when is the nice time. Go! Very nice. Let's keep going. Oh. Oh, boy. Who's through? Who's through? There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Let's go. Uh-oh. Let's go. Very nice. Okay, you guys keep going. Let's go. And... Hey, that's pretty good. Okay, so it looks like we win this one. How high did we each get? I wonder if I'm getting a new record. I wonder if we finally broke 100, because I've gotten around 97 a few times. Hey, over 100. Let's see if that gives us an achievement. Hooray, we did it. Okay, it doesn't look like there's an achievement for that. Yeah, so she has one coin left, but she loses it anyways, so that's kind of funny. But the reason that she probably didn't duel all of her coins, well, at least from a logical standpoint, is she'd think, you know what, I don't want Mario to have more coins. Okay, and Luigi's being pretty smart here using his gold pipe. I think that is a good choice. And he comes up here. I don't... Oh, that's funny that the gold pipe appears from the top of the screen, actually. I don't think... Oh, and he gets a 10. He's not reaching Waluigi, is he? He's not reaching Waluigi. That'd be crazy if Luigi reached Waluigi here. Okay, but Luigi's getting a star. Oh, and look, Peach is the only one without a star. That's actually very funny. Yeah! Oh, let's go, Mario! I got a star at two! Ha-ho! Okay, where's the next star? Luigi can still afford another one. The next star is right down there. I don't really like that location for the star. I don't like it at all. I might actually save my gold pipe for the last turn then. Oh boy, another hidden block. Don't be a star. Don't be a star. Okay, just coins. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, and only 10 coins instead of 20 coins. Okay, what's the minigame? Okay, it's Peach and I versus the other two. Peach has no stars, no coins. Guys, look at what's happening. This is the first board that we're playing in Super Mario Party Jamboree. And look, Peach is in last place with no coins, no stars. She's always in last place on my channel. How funny is that? Oh, oh. And uh, I don't know if we are actually going to win this minigame, because this minigame can sometimes be tricky. Let's see. What do we got to make? Okay, that is just this. Let's go. Hooray! That was easy. Round two. Okay, what else do we have to make? Okay, I got to make a... Is that the square on the bottom? Is it that? Okay, cool, cool. That did fit. Okay, yeah, because we didn't have a smaller square. What the? How can I make that? Oh, I guess with this... Oh, that's so interesting! Finish. Wow, I thought, wait, how are we gonna do a negative shadow? How are we gonna do a light? It seems like you want a half circle and then you want a triangle cut out of it, but that worked great. Wow, now Peach is actually getting some money, look at that! Okay, Luigi can uh, almost afford to steal a star, which is horrible. Only three we definitely don't want him to do that. Wait, is he leaving in one turn? Is he here for one more turn still? Oh wait, but Luigi's taking the other path, so Luigi's not going there. Okay, so that's good. Wait! Oh no, 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 that's the star trap, not the actual star. Star's down here. Yoshi's about to pass by it, and he can't afford the star, which is good. So maybe I should just roll normally. And you know what? I might as well put down a steel star trap. I should put that down. I guess I can't put it down there, because there's already one there, that's what I'm guessing. I think this would be a great place for it, right there. Because Yoshi's about to pass by here. Maybe Luigi's gonna be passing by there by the end of the game. You know what? Look at this. 
The shop is six away. Oh, and that's so cool that it shows you what is for sale and what the prices are. That's actually really cool that you could do that. Please give me at least a six. Come on, let's go. Yes, there we go. That's a nice big roll, okay. Okay, so there's turn nine next, and then there is turn 10 after that. So we should be able to use two gold pipes, which is crazy. Hopefully we don't lose them. Okay, so let's take this. Thank you for your purchase. Yes, you're very welcome, my Koopa Troopa friend. You know what would be so bad if we used our gold pipe? Okay, wait, where should we land? That brings us to a blue. What does that bring us to? Oh, we could land on a lucky or a blue. Hmm. Why not go up to a lucky space, get items or coins? Ah, but we're probably not going to be able to use the item since we have two of the, you know what, since we have two gold pipes already. But why not go up there? Let's see, maybe something nice will happen if we go up. Why not go onto the wiggler? Let's see, what are the options? Money would be the best. Let's see. Okay, creepy dice block. We are probably not going to be able to use that by the end of the game because I'm planning on using the... Wait. Okay, yeah, he can't afford the star. Is he gonna use Chomp Call? Creepy dice block on Luigi. That's actually great. That's actually great because... Hopefully that makes it so that he can't reach the boo and steal a star from me. Okay, and Yoshi's roll is too big, so he's not landing on my star trap. Kind of funny that there isn't a Toadette that sells you the star. The star just floats there. It's almost like it is the honor system. Okay, so Yoshi could almost afford... Actually, he can afford a star now that he is landing on a blue space. And he gets a hidden block. Don't be another star. Don't be a star. Don't be a star. Don't be a star. Don't be a star. It's a star! Okay, that's fine, that's fine, it's all right, it's all right. I have two gold pipes. As long as we're lucky with the mini, uh, not the mini stars, as long as we're lucky with the bonus stars, things might work out. Okay, Peach is using a double dice block. Let's see how that'll help her out. 32 from the star. Well, okay, seven and six, uh, 13. I don't really know if that's gonna help her much. She could pass by the shop. She can't afford a gold pipe though, because a gold pipe is 25 and she only has 20. So let's see if she is going to buy something. Kind of funny that she's still in last place all this time. Okay, double dice, very nice, very nice. Very nice. She has two items, two turns left in the game. Wait, are you coming? No, you can't land on me. You can go this way, but you're not gonna land on me. Oh! Oh, she could almost make it to uh, Waluigi. Okay, wait, I'm on Wiggler, so what's gonna happen? It just moves, right? And I stay on it, wait. Oh, oh, these spaces turn bad. Okay. So wait, a Wiggler is angry now. Wait, I don't know if he turned angry last time or if he just moved and then he went back to sleep. I can't remember what happened. Okay, Luigi's cursed, so he gets just a one. That's very nice for us. Hopefully he doesn't get a hidden block here. I wonder if any space can have a hidden block now. Okay, and let's see, Peach landed on green, so what does that become? Okay, four player minigame, that's fine. Domination, I want that. Okay, sure, treasure divers. Keep all the coins you collect, that's fine. Okay, let's go. Let's go, let's bring up some of these chests. Oh, gotta get the shark to come by. There we go, there we go, there we go. Very nice. That was a nice big chest. And, Peach, get hit. Good, 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 good. And give me that chest now. <laughs> Very nice. And can I get the other big chest also? Let's go, give me this one. Very nice. Oh, I don't think I can make it up in time. Uh-oh, look out, bloopers. Look out, bros. There we go. And, oh, there's still one left. I don't want Luigi to get that. In fact, I don't want anyone else to get that. Uh-oh, let's block him. Let's block him. Stop, Luigi. Uh-oh, wow, 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 wow. I can't believe I got hit there. Yeah, that's kind of funny. Well, everybody gets some coins, nice. That's nice, that's nice. We are going to the second last turn of the game now. Can you believe it? Oh, and Yoshi's still in first place. Hopefully not for long. Only two turns left. Okay, leave zero turns. Wait, is he leaving now? Haha, <laughs> goodbye, Waluigi. Nobody got him. Ah, oh, Waluigi left! Okay, my turn. Okay, I'm only six from the star, so it's kind of funny to be using a gold pipe, but there are only two turns left in the game, and I have two gold pipes. So, might as well use it. And... I believe we don't want to get a two or a three. If we get a two or a three, let's have a look again. 
If we get a two or a three, then we fall into a star trap. Or wait, no, 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 sorry, I think a two or a four. Yeah, a two or a four. So if I get a one, I just land on my own. That probably does nothing. So just don't get a two or a four, anything but two or four. Yes! Uh, thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hopefully that is a good roll. And we probably get some more money for passing by the Koopa Bank now. Or, well, not the Koopa Bank, I guess just the Koopa Troopa that gives you coins as you pass by him. Yahoo! Okay, where's the next star? The next star is... Right up there! I don't think we can pass by a boo if we do that, can we? Okay, and I don't think there's a point in buying an item from the shop. Maybe there's a most items purchased bonus star. So maybe I should buy something. Maybe I should buy something very, very cheap, even if I can't use it. The cheapest thing is regular pipe, which is four coins. So, might as well buy, because I don't know if there's a bonus star for most items purchased. So, I'm going to buy that just in case. Because we are pretty far ahead in terms of coins. Oh, big spender achievement earned. Nice. Okay, now lucky or blue? Let's go lucky. Let's see, hopefully it's not an item, hopefully it's money. Let's see. Okay, seven coins, all right! All right, one coin better than landing on a blue space, which is pretty funny. And in this game, I don't know if hidden blocks can be on any kind of spot. Because in Mario Party Superstars, hidden blocks can only appear on blue spaces. Okay, Yoshi's 24 away, using a double dice block, can't reach. But he gets an eight and a nine, a gigantic roll. So he can really go pretty far. Are you buying something? You're not buying- yeah, you're not gonna buy a gold pipe, are you? He has a chomp call. Uh, I wonder, I wonder, he might be able to get another star still, which is crazy. Oh, and I'm back in first place, which is nice. Hopefully he doesn't get another star from a hidden block. Okay, he didn't get it this turn, which is good. Now, Peach, what about you? Custom dice block, what do you want to roll? What do you want to roll? Are you gonna do something smart nine away from the star? That's an eight. That actually makes sense, given that she is one coin short for the star. Oh! Oh! Peach will now receive three coins for landing on this. And then, it's a versus, versus space now. A versus minigame. Okay. That's gonna be fun. Okay, how many coins are we going to wager? Ten coins. Okay, so this is really similar to Mario Party Superstars, the way that it works. That's kind of cool, the way that it's a split screen like this. What's the minigame? Gate key- No! Ah, oh, man. Man, this minigame is so luck dependent. This is probably one of the worst minigames in this game, I think. Okay, who's up first? Peach is up first. Great. She might just get it on the first try. Let's see, what does she choose? Diamond key? On the right gate. Does it work? No, it does not work, okay. So now, if we try and open the right gate, we have a one in four chance. Okay, Luigi also uses the diamond key. On the left gate. And... That also does not work. It'd be so funny if diamond key in the middle gate was actually the right answer. But there's no way to know that. So let's try using square key on the right gate. Will this work? One in four chance. Hey! We got it! Let's go! Oh man, oh man, I still don't like this minigame, even though I got really lucky like that. Because winning this minigame didn't even really matter that much, it wasn't too important. Okay, and Yoshi got it on the first try also, very nice. He had a 1 in 3 chance of getting that, because he knew that it wasn't diamond key on the left, that it had to be one of the other keys. Wow, and Peach got it this time, so Luigi's in last place. So sad for Luigi. Let's see how the coins are going to be distributed now. Okay, Peach gets 4. Yoshi gets eight. I get 28, which is actually amazing, because I can now buy and steal a star, which is crazy. That's quite nice. Okay, so Luigi's up next, and then it is going to be the minigame. Kind of cool how you can see whose turn it is, what's next, just by looking at the bottom of this screen like that. Okay, where's Luigi going? Not taking that path, coming down this way. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. What are you buying? Spends 10 coins on what? Another star steal trap. Uh-oh. But wait. He's the last person to go, and next turn is the final turn, so he can't even catch anybody with that, so that's actually pretty funny. Wait. Thank goodness he cannot afford to steal a star right now. He's probably stealing from me. Yeah, stealing from me because I'm in first place and I have the most points, so that makes sense. Let's smash, hey? There we go. I guess I filled in the bar. 
Okay, and still had 10 coins stolen from me. That's too bad. But I guess it could be a lot worse. Where are you landing, Luigi? Oh, he's getting close to my Star Steel Trap. It'd be so nice if he landed on my Star Steel Trap. Oh, bonus minigame. Get double the coins. Nice. Okay, a four-player minigame. What is the minigame going to be? It is. Sled to the edge. I was hoping it'd be domination. All right, watch the example closely. Okay, three penguins. Three penguins. Empty. Okay. Right before the one penguin is where the first one let go. Okay, I got it, I got it, I got it, I see. Okay, so it's shortly after the empty one that you want to let go. Okay, so let's see. There's three penguins, then another three penguins soon. You got three penguins, and it's going to be empty. And around here, I went a bit late, I think. Let's see, is Luigi falling off? Or is he playing insanely well? Uh, Luigi's in last. I'm at 13.33 yards. Okay, so we are in first. Very nice. Played it a bit safe there. Okay, so that's nice. We get 20 coins for that. Nice that we're getting all of this money. Hopefully, we can maintain our lead. Final turn. Because, yeah, there are going to be bonus stars. It's the final turn of the game now. And what we need to do, of course, is use our golden pipe. Brings us to in front of the star. And what are we going to roll after that? What do we want to roll is the question. Okay, so the star is up here. Let's have a look at what is in front of us and what we could possibly reach. Oh, I'm on the same spot as Peach. That's so funny. Okay, so I definitely don't want a two. Anything but a two. Six would let us land on Luigi. If we get at least a six, that's actually incredible. And I don't want a nine. A nine would be too scary. So anything but a two, at least a six, and not a nine. Come on! Yes! Okay, 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 okay! That's actually very good. We get another star. Wait! We pass by the boo! We can steal a star, and we're not landing on chance time? You got a star! Uh, hopefully we're also not landing on a star trap. I believe the star trap was nine away. Imagine if we land on a star trap. How sad would that be? I could almost reach- oh wait, no, I can't almost reach it because you have to do a loop to get around to that, so never mind, I'm not almost reaching that. Okay, but- oh, the item shop is closed, makes sense. And... I think it makes a lot more sense to steal a star right now. Peach in last place, so sad for her. We're definitely stealing a star from Yoshi here because he is only one star behind us right now. Wait, did Luigi steal a star from us at the beginning of the game? I can't remember if it was Luigi or Yoshi who stole a star from us. But we're not holding a grudge, we're just being calculating, and we are making what is mathematically the best choice right now to give us the best odds of winning. And... Oh, nice! All the options are just coins. Ten coins! Nice, 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 and very nice. That's what I can say. Oh, so look at this! At the bottom of the screen, you can see that after the mini-game, we are going to go to the results. Good job, Yoshi, rolling a five. Oh, cool, someone actually lands on the honey. What happens when you land on the honey? You get some coins or something? Help me harvest honey! Okay, pick one. You get honey or bees? Oh, cool, you get some honey, nice. Do you get to go again or what's gonna happen? Okay, some honey comes out and... Okay, three honeys. Oh, 16 coins, that's nice. The honey you harvested is worth 16 coins, you can try one more time. Okay. What is this, like the Monty Hall problem or something? They go, you can choose to have this door or switch to the other door. The math behind the Monty Hall problem is actually so interesting. I think they talked about that in the novel The Curious Incident of the Dog in the Nighttime, if I remember correctly. But there we go, that's another 17 coins for Yoshi there. All right, Princess Peach, it is your turn. Using the double dice block 30 away from the star, so she's not reaching the star. There's nothing she can do. 10 and 1. The largest possible roll and the smallest possible roll combined. And... Wait. Oh, she can only steal coins. She can't steal a star, which is nice. Yoshi can afford to steal a star, which is bad. Okay, I don't want too many coins stolen from me. So let's start mashing here. There we go. Looks like I filled in that bar, which is nice. Okay, and only 9 coins were stolen that time. 
I'm down to 19 coins, so I can't afford another star, but it's the final turn of the game, so it doesn't matter anyways. Oh! Peach lands on me! You wanna duel? You wanna duel? You wanna have a duel? I'll duel you, Peach! How many coins do you wanna duel for? I have 19. Okay, cool. Dueling 18 coins now. One less than the maximum. Just like last time, except last time she had three coins and she chose to duel two. Master Duelist achievement earned. Well, hopefully I can show that I am going to be the Master Duelist here. Let's just punch her. Go! Ha 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 Uh-oh! Uh-oh! You're still doing well! Okay, let's go like this. There we go. This looks like a good way to go. And... There we go. Made it to the end. Very nice. I thought that maybe I'd have to punch her again. That's nice that I even get more money now. 36 more coins. So I am now... Oh wait, no, no, not 36 more coins. I had only one coin left and then I was given 36. So I'm up to 37 because we were dueling for 18. So I had 19 before the duel started. That makes sense because 19 plus 18 is 37. You're putting down a star steel trap. But, but why? Why? No one's going. The game's the game's over, Luigi. And he already had a star steel trap that he didn't use from a previous turn. That's something that I was thinking about earlier. Okay, and oh, oh, it'd be so funny if he got one more. Then he would have landed on my star steel trap. Man, the star steel trap really is quite scary. It adds quite a bit of chaos to the game. Things can go crazy. Okay, one versus three minigame. On again, off again. Okay, this is my first time being on the team of three for this minigame, so I don't know if we can survive. Okay, let's see. Hopefully we can do all right. Okay, that's coming down there. Whoa, boy. Let's go. Just gotta do some jumping here. Okay, it's all up to me now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let's go like this. Uh-oh. Let's go there. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Let's see. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, there we go. We survived. Very nice. Oh man, that was fun. And not too crazy. Great job, everyone. Now it's time to gather up for the results. So, who's going to be the winner here? Oh, nice carpet there. You all did a great job out there. There can only be one superstar. Looks like you have an audience here to cheer you on for the finale. All right, so I guess there are gonna be bonus stars. I won't make you wait too much longer. Direct your eyes to the monitor. Who will be the winner? First, let's check out what star distribution looked like throughout the game. And? Oh, I'm in the lead over there. And then someone stole my star. Okay, I guess Yoshi stole my star. Here, Yoshi has me to steal a star from Mario. Oh, and then look at this. Oh, man, look at that. Mario got a whole two stars in one turn here. Oh, yeah, because I stole a star and I bought a star. Now, I'll present the bonus stars. The first bonus is... Eventful bonus. That actually might be going to Peach, because she landed on a few event spaces. Yeah, I thought it would be Peach. Is she not going to be in last place? Is Princess Peach not going to be in last place? I think she might still be in last place. Sightseer bonus. Who traveled the most spaces? That might also be Peach. I don't know if it's Peach or me or who. Oh, okay, nice. That is Mario. Mario took the most of spaces. Yahoo! And is that all? All right, without further ado, it's time to announce the winner. Who will be the superstar? I hope Peach is in last place so much because she's always in last place on my channel. Let's see. First time superstar achievement earned. Congratulations. Mario oh, is the winner. A well earned victory. How about we take a look at some of the finer details? Peach is in last place. That is so good. Pro rules added. You can now play with pro rules in Mario Party. I wonder what that is. I guess we'll see. We have played all mini games in Super Mario Party Jamboree and done all of the boss fights. And you've got to see that video. You can check it out in the pinned comment. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have an absolutely amazing day ahead of you. And take care, everybody.